Hey everyone, welcome to DARPA Instaclass. Very exciting times for BCIT's Burnaby campus. They are investing $162.6 million in trades and technology, and they are going to get a trades and technology complex. It's going to allow a lot of students to pursue their dreams. You are going to hear from Wayne Hand. He is the Dean with the School of Construction and the Environment. At BCIT, there are three schools that have trades in it. Ours is, is one of those, fortunately. So we have all of the construction trades, a lot of technologies and degrees that relate to construction. So programs like uh, architectural building technology, civil engineering, <clears throat> and uh, construction management. And then we also have master's programs in uh, building science. So uh, the opportunity for a trade and technology complex at BCIT is quite uh, special from the point of view that um, we're going to be able to expose everything from trades through to master's degrees in terms of the best practices and most recent uh, changes in technology that apply to the construction sector. So this came about from the fact that um, and there's a skill shortage uh, looming here. It's been uh, pressing and growing for a number of years within the province across the country actually but especially here in the lower mainland so bcit is fortunate enough to have made an application to the uh, provincial government for supporting the project which uh, sort of resulted last week's announcement of the trade and technology complex it's really going to allow us to showcase uh, what a career path in the construction sector is all about it is going to accommodate trades degree uh, diploma degree and master students in the same building there's going to be an opportunity it'll be very visual inside in terms of understanding what's going on in different areas uh, hopefully it'll uh, motivate people to look at career in construction we have an accredited civil engineering program that's going to go in there our building science program is going to go in there uh, we're going to have uh, uh, classes in there from our piping departments welding departments uh, as well as gas fitter so it's going to be um, it's going to be a, a very exciting area to go right. into. We will be expanding our footprint on the campus here to be able to deliver more carpentry uh, apprenticeship programs, but also adding into that, uh, you know, there's some changes that are taking place in terms of construction around mass timber. So this is going to help us provide trades workers and technologists with uh, expertise and understanding about how to manufacture with mass timber. The other area that uh, is a separate building is a new covered area in our steel trade yard. Uh, we've been working a lot with uh, the shipbuilding sector here in the Lower Mainland. So we have a marine fitter program within our uh, boilermaker and metal fabrication apprenticeship. So it will allow us to handle large scale mock-ups of uh, ship uh, building activities. So BCIT, we really focus on um, you know, a skilled workforce that we're delivering. So it's it's good to hear from industry. They, a lot of donations there, but they are also really seriously saying, you know, they're giving us the money, but they also are wanting to have a stronger connection with BCIT. It's exciting times for those wanting to get into trades and technology in the various fields that you did mention. And it's a great time to explore the career path within that field. Uh, thank you so much, Wayne Hand, for taking the time to speak with us. Yeah, it was, thank you for the interview. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube. Like, share, and subscribe.